Are the headlines about AI-driven job losses making you rethink your workforce strategy? Don't get ahead of yourself. I spoke to Gartner's Emily Rose McRae, and her take is clear. Enterprise-level investments that Gartner refers to as everyday AI boast individual productivity, but they don't lead to broad headcount reductions. Why? Because unless organizations redesign workflows, not just add tools, productivity gains aren't significant enough to cut jobs. So what about all those high-profile, quote-unquote, AI layoffs? They're more about company performance in talent remix than automation. In fact, Gartner predicts that through 2028, AI investments can lead to a net headcount increase for the enterprise, with decreases in some jobs and business units and increases in others. More so, unrealistic, uninformed, seemingly arbitrary headcount reduction targets do not support long-term success. So tread carefully. Want to learn more? Visit Gartner.com. And to attend our new webinar on AI's impact on headcount, layoff, and business value, find the link in this post or in our Instagram bio.